Laura Bedard, author of What Do I Wear to the Execution, has released her fictional novel based on the character of Dr. Sarah Jefferson, who broke glass ceilings in becoming warden of Crawford Correctional. What's it like to be one of the first women to run a maximum security prison with inmates on death row? As we start Sarah's story, we realize that she didn't get to the position of warden easily or even by choice. Her winding journey begins in her college years when her brother commits suicide and she decides to dedicate her life to helping the mentally ill. Soon after, she starts her career in a state mental hospital, which ultimately leads to her work in a prison known for the Crawford Curse. At Crawford, Sarah reports to Warden Giles, a hateful man who almost destroys her good name. Sarah's relationship with Giles was always rocky, and when he announces the premature death of Victor Valentine, an inmate who had only days to live before making his scheduled execution, Sarah notices Giles is shaking. Is he somehow connected to Valentine's murder? Surrounded by lies and corruption, Sarah wants her freedom and starts to plan her escape. But when the tides shift, she's forced to become the next warden at Crawford. Dedicating herself to the task, she begins to clean up the streets from inside the prison with a project she develops to transform the lives of the inmates. Read What Do I Wear to the Execution and discover how Sarah evolves from working in a 100-year-old mold-infested facility to success as one of the first female wardens to lead a maximum security prison now available on Amazon.